Shamsia Hassani working on her latest mural. As with most of her art, the women portrayed carry a message of oppression and empowerment. She can use music and instrument to talk with people, to speak louder and make more attention. Uh, as she has no mouth, but this music and instrument gives her power to speak in society. Her eyes are closed uh, because uh, usually uh, she has nothing good around herself to see and she, she doesn't want to see anything around. And sometimes she cannot see her future, but it doesn't mean that uh, she cannot see. Hassani was born in Aram after her family fled the Afghan war. They eventually returned to Kabul so Hassani could pursue a fine art education at Kabul University, where she now teaches. The opportunity to attend the Istanbul festival and work in a more relaxed environment gives Hassani a welcome break from the pressures of being a graffiti artist in Kabul and it gives her the chance to share her experiences with an appreciative audience. I think that art, is, uh, art cannot change anything directly. It's very difficult to change the situation with art. Art is changing people's minds, and people's minds will change the society. Hassani has already built up an impressive number of works, even in the face of violence and extreme challenges women artists face. I really scare of of public spaces. I really scare from explosions happening all the time. And that's like, that's usually like, uh, I, I feel usually very hopeless because there are a lot of bad things happening around my, me and I cannot change anything. And specifically, uh, it's difficult for women to do graffiti and street art because usually people uh, are not happy with uh, women's activity. I usually work in Kabul, but uh, usually in a small walls, not in big walls, because I cannot finish them. I need to just just run away as soon as I can. So that's why I start in the small walls. At the festival, Hassani has a rare opportunity to spend a few days on her work, a luxury she says she never gets back home. Despite the dangers, Hassani says she will continue to bring colour and hope to the people of Kabul. Dorian Jones for VOA News, Istanbul.